Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about oats and skincare and we're comparing Crave Oats on Simple Water Cream and O Gel Moisturizer from Avino. So if you wanna know which one is right for you, make sure you watch the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, hit the bell, you know the drill. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. And I really wanted to do this video on oats today because it's one of my favorite skincare ingredients. Uh, oats, either in the form of colloidal oatmeal, 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 um, uh, extract, water, they are very soothing. They're rich in uh, antioxidants, beta glucans, and lipids. And this powerful combination is gonna help this restore the skin barrier. So it's good for eczema prone skin, it's good for sensitive skin. So if you're facing any re irritation or redness, this is, or even if you don't, this, <laughs> this is definitely an ingredient that I think you should consider having um, in a moisturizer, uh, like in one of these two, or in a cleanser, for example. Uh, obviously, it's gonna be a little bit less effective, but the old cleansing balm uh, from the Inkey List, I did a review recently, I'm gonna put it up here so you can check uh, that one out as well. So let's jump into um, the products, ingredients, and comparing a little bit of the, t uh, of the texture. Okay, so the Oto Simple Water Cream, this one I'll be using uh, for a little bit longer. Um, it's from Crave. This one retails for $28 uh, for 80 ml, so it's um, it's a nice, nice size. I really enjoy um, the texture. This is by far one of my favorite uh, textures. Uh, the packaging, I'm not too crazy about the packaging. This lid is a little bit hard, so, but, I really, really enjoy this one. This is a more lightweight um, consistency, so I usually use in the morning. I'm gonna put it over uh, sunscreen, it's fine, it's the end of the day. So I really, really like this one. It sinks in very nicely, it's very lightweight. This for the morning moisturizer if you use it. Um, remember, uh, sunscreens are already in a, usually in a moisturizing vehicle, so I really don't like to apply a very thick moisturizer in the morning. So this is definitely a very good and solid option. In terms of ingredients, the highlights, I'm gonna put them all up here, but we have water and in this case water, um, the old water is included here because you really can um, disclose, them, uh, disclose them separately. So we have water with the old water. Um, we have caprylic triglyceride, which is an emollient that's gonna help soften the skin, with squalane, which is another emollient. Uh, and we have some preservatives and the Avena Sativa uh, Meal Extract, which is the old extract in this case. Um, very simple, straightforward uh, ingredient list, free of fragrances, essential oils, and um, any dyes, and etc. So very minimalistic, straightforward. It's not very occlusive, like I said, so if you really want something more towards the dry, uh, damaged skin, this is not gonna be a good option for you. But if you want something more lightweight for the morning, um, this is definitely uh, a product that I recommend. The texture is, <laughs> is really, really good. Okay, so I really enjoyed it. Let's talk about now the the opponent, the the the, re, the new recent comer, Avino has so many products with oats. They have the so uh, whole eczema line, and more uh, more recently they launched the the Calm and Restore line, um, which has three products. It has the cleanser, which I really enjoy, good for sensitive skin. It has the serum, which I have it, but I haven't tried it out yet. I have so many products, so um, I haven't opened yet. Um, and haha, I have so many products. No, I didn't mean I didn't mean it like that. <laughs> Just meant that I'm using other products now, okay? And, and then there's the moisturizer. So this is almost gone. This one retails for um, $17.99 for 48 um, grams. So this one is a little bit more expensive actually. Um, and is a little bit more occlusive. Okay, so I put it on that side. So if you, I really enjoyed this one as a nighttime moisturizer to uh, apply before retinoids. Uh, so I really, really enjoy it. And the reason why it's more occlusive, it, it this one is it has dimethicone, so it definitely is a little bit thicker. Okay, now let's jump uh, into the product, into the ingredients. 
let me just open here so we can have the main ingredients this one has glycerin which is a humectant like i said it has dimethicone that's why it's a little bit more occlusive it has the avena sativa flower and the extract so it has uh, these two versions it has bee wax which is gonna also help with the um, with the thicker texture it has now then some preservatives and etc it has pentheno which is vitamin b5 which is also very soothing to the skin we really like pentheno and it has two additional soothing extracts it has feverfew the flower leaf and stem juice which apparently has been this is a flower extract that usually has fragrance uh components but apparently it's if you if you filter out and taste take a specific part it, it's not that irritating so um and it can be it can be very soothing so this is very good uh and apparently they did that according to the website and they also have centella asiatica which is another extract in this case a plant extract that we really like um and it's very soothing to the skin as well so this has a little bit more going on uh you could say that this could <laughs> could cause uh has potential for more irritation but overall it's very minimal because it's not it's really not that many many ingredients i've never had any issues with both of the products so um, i really think they're they're a good option there's no way uh, for me to predict if i uh, uh either one is gonna be um, irritating or maybe have a reaction so you really need to test them out but make sure you choose based on on what what you need and where you're going to use them you know if you if you need a morning moisturizer i would go with the crave one if you want a th more thick um heavier moisturizer for the evening i would go with the avino one okay so let me know i really uh i really enjoyed oats like i said uh, pursue try to find uh, uh, an, a product that you like that has and and try to incorporate in, in your routine and let me know if you're using today any products that has um, oats either in one of these forms that we talked about and what are your favorite products uh, with this ingredient thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next video bye bye